What is good, y'all? This is JV here, and today I got a reaction for you guys. Super hyped about this one. Uh, we got Tribeast. This was a suggestion by uh, a viewer. Really excited to check this out. Don't really know who this artist is or group of artists. I'm not sure if it's a group or an individual. Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited to get into it. Before I start, I do apologize about the lighting. Had some trouble with the lighting and I'm filming at night and so I hope it's, it's not too bad. Um, but yeah, let's just get into it. We got a long one here. It's practically seven minutes long, the video. So let's just get into it. Again, we have Tribeast. Let's go. Days Alive. For seven minutes, this, this song and visual better be on point. So we have some really crazy visual shit going on. Okay, you got like the cholo look going on. <laughs> Sounds like some marimba or vibe touches, vibraphone touches. Okay, so it's a smoother track. Some jazz keys there on the instrumental. Hey, I like this instrumental. I like the drum kit they use in the instrumental. Here's some scratching under there, too. Ah, kill it. Some really dope editing going on here too, and that that framing, that that shot right there is really dope. Wow. Is that in Korea? Wow, that shit looks like like the Midwest prairies. <laughs> Love is aggression. It's energy too. I like that. That's catchy. That's old school with the vibe of it. Super artsy though, the way it's filmed. The lighting is beautiful too. Oh, shit done change. They, they flipped that Vicky sample. Okay. Okay. Now it's getting trippy on us. Went from some 90s, 90s artsy shit to some like spaced out Kid Cudi shit. <laughs> on some Flatbush zombie shit. Okay, well, we got to change the outfit. Complete change. So I guess, yeah, his, his name is Tribeast. I wonder how long he's been rapping. I've actually never heard of him before this point. Ah. Love the street feel that it took on the second half there. It's kind of like, again, like an artsy 90s kind of street feel. Homeboy spitting in the record shop too. It definitely got, it fits the retro feel to the song. And I wonder if this is like a mix of multiple tracks, you know, for the length. Or is this just one seven minute track? Uh, I like it, but this is an amazing like first look into an MC, just seeing him go at it for this long. And the visuals are super entertaining. 
I've always had like a genuine appreciation for graffiti so street art. I wonder who did the production on this. This would be tough. Love some of the visual things going on through that, like VHS look to it. And I, I watch a lot of old rap videos, so this is, even though I've never seen this before and I don't really know this MC, there's, there's like a nostalgia kind of like attributed to it. Just from the, the instrumental and uh, the visual standpoint. Yeah, I like that. It's super catchy. I try to call it. You can definitely tell. He definitely has a love for that 90s East Coast shit, for sure. I say East Coast just because of the instrumental style. Basically. I'm telling you, this is like multiple tracks. If you use it to one. I kind of like, the, yeah, the impact, the drums sync up with the piano and then it's kind of just like gone after that point. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, mean, I am curious as to who who produced this track, and I wonder if it's multiple producers, considering that the instrumentals are different, uh, switching up every you know few minutes, and I wonder who did who was in charge of the visuals. Again, like it's so dynamic from top to bottom that it makes me like wonder, you know, how many people had their hands in the the construction of this and what this actually is. Is this meant to be one solid experience, or is it like a couple tracks into one? Or I mean, of, of all the times that I've heard of MC for the first time, this definitely has to be one of the strongest, man. Uh, yeah, an, an excellent showcase. It's dope that it's kind of like a self-titled track, too, as well. Shout out to Tribeast, man. Absolutely love this track. The instrumentation was was amazing, top to bottom. Uh, again, I was, I was talking about in the middle part. Man, I'm you know, I'm a sucker for that 90s hip-hop, and this uh, definitely, you know, paid a lot of homage to that, you know, from a visual perspective and the audio perspective, and some of the samples flipped on, upside down. I mean, uh, inside the beat, you know, uh, during the DJ scratch and stuff like that. So, shout out to Tribeast. I really enjoyed it. Thank you so much for the suggestion. I'm curious as to what y'all thought about it. So, in the comment section below, let me know what you thought about the song and the music video. Till next time, this is JV. I love you guys. Bye.